What is going on, everybody? Back with some more NBA Best Bets. Got five plays for you guys today. Hopefully, we can sweep the board. I'm going to go ahead and throw this out there. There is not much on prize picks right now. This is pretty much everything on the board. Zero goblin plays right now. Sucks, so there won't be a goblin play of the day. I got two NBA props for you, and then I have three college basketball plays for you guys. We've been killing college. If you guys uh, are interested in that, we do have a lot of college slips in our VIP for today, so make sure you guys head on over there for that. But anyways, guys, horrible day in our free picks yesterday. Ended up 1-3 in three on our free picks. We had two hooks. Booker hooked us. We had um, a hook from Kuzma on his assists. Our goblin play missed. Uh, KD couldn't get 25 points. He had 11 in the first quarter. Not sure what happened with that. Didn't get to watch the game. But anyways, the only one that hit yesterday was Ananobi, which really, really sucks. Not much I can do about it. But um, yeah, once again, Price Picks won't let me log in on Chrome. So I had to open it up on this uh, whatever. I don't even know what this is called. Microsoft Edge, whatever. Anyway, <clears throat> that sucks. But anyways, picking a winner from yesterday's video. From the comments so if you're new to the channel if we hit 50 comments and 200 likes on this video i pick a random comment to win a free month of vip and if we hit 400 likes i pick two of you so we did hit the threshold for one uh, month of vip yesterday so we'll go ahead and pick our winner right now drum roll for the winner is pimp paul 6930 said love the comment uh, content really appreciate that man send me a message on discord i'll get you your free month of vip appreciate the Appreciate the love and support from everybody. Make sure you drop a comment, like, and sub on this video for your chance at winning in tomorrow's video. But um, anyways, guys, if you do want to get all of our plays, you can head on over to our Patreon. It is $25 a month. You get every single play that we post, every player mods post. Our mods have been killing it, and I uh, highly recommend you guys join for that, especially if you're wanting to get in for MLB and college basketball. MLB is one of our best sports by far. College basketball, if you've been telling the free picks, we had a pretty dang good season so far this year for college basketball. But anyways, all of our plays are linked on our Patreon down in the description. Make sure you get that. Last plug of the day, and I'll leave you guys alone. First, the website that we use in this video is called DGF or DG Fantasy. This is a platform. It takes all of our plays from our apps like Price Picks and Underdog, uh, compares them directly to sports books. It gives us percent odds to hit or a positive EV value. Makes line shopping super, super easy. These are all ML, uh, NBA plays that you can look from. <clears throat> really, really good for research. Highly recommend everybody have this. You get a 25% off discount if, you, discount if you use our link in the description. It is code ACES. Then the other one is called outlier.bet. This is the one we use to see all of the charts. Love this platform too. If you guys want to get a seven-day free trial, link is down in the description as well. But let's go ahead and jump into these free picks, guys. So first free pick of the day. Like I said, no goblin, so I can't lock this in as a goblin play, which sucks, but uh, first one is going to be for our man Zion Williamson, and I'm locking him in over RA today. So they got him at 11.5 RA on prize picks. The value for this is like 1.6x on chalkboard, so you're getting better value on prize picks, which is really, really good at a 1.77, so better payout. So I'm going to pull up Zion here. <clears throat> I'm going to go to RA. And Pelicans are playing the Clippers tonight, so it should be a fairly competitive game. Should be a decently fast-paced game. Minus 132 for FanDuel, minus 130 DraftKings for him to go over. 54% chance to go over. He's cashed this in three of his last four, six of his last 10, 55% of his last 20, and then only 41% on the season. But he's been playing really well of late, uh, as of lately. Uh, last game played versus the Clippers back on February 7th. He did cash with 13, and then the other two this season, he actually – or he's cashed – yeah, that's from last season or so – yeah, so he's cashed two, uh, one of three games this season, which isn't the best versus the Clippers. But like I said, he's been killing it lately. You can see that one game he had 19 minutes. It was a blowout, so obviously that one doesn't even really count. But out of his last 10, he's cashed six, and out of his last four, he's cashed three of these. So looking at the Clippers, they give up fifth and 13th in rebounds and assists. If you go to power forward, it's 21st and 19th. So they give up a lot of stats to the position. I think Zion's going to be able to get 12 for us tonight. I like the play. His ceiling's really way up there. You can see the, uh, over on the season, I think his highest one was uh, – yeah, he had 19. So that's his highest this season so far, 19 RA, which is way over this number, almost double. Like to play a lot. Got to lock in our man Zion Williamson. So we're going to pull him up over here on underdog, see if they have him. 11.5 RA, it is on underdog as well. So that is pick number one and our first NBA pick. Jumping into our second and our last NBA pick of the day, taking Trey Jones over rebounds. So I love this play, man. He has been killing this line. They are playing against Denver tonight, which means it's going to be kind of a tough matchup, but 
Looking at this, it's minus 154 on FanDuel, minus 150 DraftKings, minus 170 on Caesar. Really good value. 60% um, chance to go over. He's cashed his nine of his last 10 games. He's cashed at 70% of his last 20, 57% on the season. Head to head, his last game versus Denver, the only one this season, which is on the uh, November, he had uh, four rebounds, so he did cash this line pretty easily. Looking at Denver, they give up seventh in the league in rebounds. To the shooting guard position, they give up six. Point guard, they give up 10th. So they don't give up many boards, but three is not that many. And Trey Jones has been absolutely killing this. I will say this this uh this play is not on prize picks. You're going to have to get it on sleeper or chalkboard if you have either of those. So Trey Jones, see they don't have uh don't have it on here right now. Points and rebounds is on there, but I prefer just the rebounds myself. So we'll check underdog real quick just to make sure they didn't add it. Yeah, they didn't. So this is going to be a sleeper slash chalkboard play. If you guys do sign up using our disc our code on chalkboard or sleeper, you do get do get a free month of VIP. So highly recommend you guys do that. Love the Trey Jones play. Probably one of my favorite NBA plays on the slate. So uh, highly recommend you guys get it before it's taken down or bumped to three. But uh, that is pick number two. So jumping into pick number three, this is when we go over to the college basketball section of the video. So if you can't play college, I do apologize. But there's so many college games, man. We've been doing really well in college. Really wanted to put some free picks out there for the guys that like college too. So first pick is going to be for our man Tyson Walker. So we're locking in Tyson Walker over PRA, 22.5. <clears throat> It's minus 125 to go over, 56% chance to go over. He's cast his six of his last 10 games. Our man Tyson has a massive usage of 30%. He's, uh, the volume's definitely going to be there. He's attempted at least 15 shots in seven straight games. So you can go over here, you can go to field goals. He's attempted at least 15 with 21 in two straight games. But uh, being smashing this, getting a lot of usage, shooting a lot of shots. It's a huge matchup. They're playing against Purdue tonight. Uh, it's a Big Ten tourney. A win here could be a huge for Michigan State come Sunday. Walker's going to play all the minutes he can handle here. I think he's going to have a great game. He hit this in three of his last four. As you can see, he hooked the one he missed with 22 versus uh, or, uh, back on uh, the 14th, which was yesterday. But anyway, like to play a lot. He had 25 PRA against Purdue on uh on March 2nd. So love the play. Looking at Purdue, they don't give up a ton of stats. 124th in points, 5th in rebounds, 297th in assists, though. But love the play for our man Tyson Walker. Got to lock him in. We'll go ahead and pull it up over here on Underdog. This is where we locked him in. Um, okay, it's on NBA. I was, about, I was about to say, they did not take this down on me, did they? So home. All right, Walker. Tyson Walker. P-R-A. It looks like they did take points, rebounds, and assists down. That sucks. See if it's back on prize picks. See if it's on prize picks. I did not mean to open up my stream labs, but college basketball. Tyson Walker, 22.5 P-R-A. They got it at 23. It's okay to take a 23. Just adds push potential. They actually have goblin plays for college right now, but not for NBA. Okay, whatever. Anyway, Tyson Walker, 22.5 P-R-A is our first play of the day. Hopefully, it comes back up on, under, on underdog. It's probably going to be bumped, honestly. But that's pick number one for college. Jumping into pick number two, we're going over to our boy Terrence Shannon Jr., taking him over PRA as well. So two PRA plays, over 25 and a half, 55% to go over, minus 125, and then minus 120 on underdog. So it is still an underdog. He's cashed this in seven of his last 10 games, three of his last four. Dude's been killing this lately. This game has a massive total of 153 points, which if you don't know, in college, it's a big total. Shannon and this Illinois team will have fresh legs. They haven't played a game since March 10th. So uh, he should be ready to play, should be on fire. Shannon's another player with a massive usage. He's hit this in seven of his last nine, as you can see. He also had 29 PRA against the same team on January 29th. So I think he's going to get this again here tonight. Looking at uh, OSU, they play, uh, they give up 20, uh, 95th in points, 132nd in rebounds, 61st in assists. So don't give up a ton of stats, but with this high total game, I think our, our boy Terrence Shannon is definitely going to be able to get 26 PRA for so I'm going to be locking him in so we'll go over here over here to underdog 25 and a half should be on prize picks as well and it is not so it's not on prize picks it is on underdog you can't get it on underdog so uh it should be on a chalkboard and sleeper as well if you want to play on either of those platforms but uh Terrence Shannon Jr over 25 and a half PRA is our next pick and there's some loud thunder going on right now if you can hear that but 
fifth final pick of the pick of the day going over to Anderson Garcia and if I can spell his name right it might actually come up but taking his PRA as well and we're taking him under so this is the only under we have today on our free picks taking him under 18 and a half PRA minus 120 on FanDuel they're, they're kind of leaning towards the over on this I disagree they're playing against UK if you know me I'm a UK fan which is uh, maybe I'm a little bit biased but I do think this play is going to be a little bit sweaty. So playing under, UK has several defensive big men here. Garcia only averages 17 PRA on the season. He's hit this in three of his last six games, which you can see. So it's going to be a little bit sweaty, like I said. Um, uh, I think they're going to be trailing the majority of the game in this one. And I think Garcia is he's rarely used in the offense. So I think he's going to stay that way. He only had 14 PRA back against Kentucky uh, in January. So I think it's going to be kind of the same thing. Looking at Kentucky, they give up a massive amount of stats. 338th in points, 278th in rebounds, 302 in assists. But still, I think Garcia is going under tonight. Maybe he has a massive game in caches. If you want to fade it, you can. But I'm taking him under 18.5 PRA. So we'll pull him up over here on underdog under 18 and a half this one was on prize picks earlier as well hopefully it still is everything is getting taken down but i will see if nba now has some goblins and they don't but anyway those are our five plays of the day so first pick we had zion williamson over 11 and a half ra second pick we had trey jones over two and a half rebounds we had terrence shannon jr over 25 and a half pra anderson garcia under 18 and a half pra and then our last pick was uh Tyson Walker over 22 and a half PRA. So hopefully we can go 5 and 0. That'll be an amazing comeback from yesterday's 1 and 3 video, which obviously I'm not happy about. But anyways, guys, make sure you leave a comment on the video, leave a like, hit the sub button. I appreciate all of you. Hope you have an amazing day, and I'll see you in the next one.